Hi everyone! Hey. hey, we are at Ever After Scrapbooks in Vista, California. We're doing what? Yeah, for a sure. make and take. Yes. A make and take. They are celebrating, um, how do we describe this? Well, they filmed The Locator, which is a reality show mm -hmm. where they reunite families. And right. They filmed that here. Mm -hmm. And they're airing it tonight. They're airing it a tonight. Movie party. Yeah, it's a big movie party, and we're here doing make and takes and eating popcorn and stuff like that. But let's show you around the store, and then Johanna has a cute little project to show you yeah. too for the for spring and other parties. So cupcakes. Okay, so let's look around the store. And the American okay. Crafts. I love all these Alpha blends. And these are Prima. Yes, they have all the latest Prima so stuff. So cute. Let me see. Got yeah, the they Prima. have great stuff here. Love this. Look at the transparencies, but they have um, texture to them. That's right. And who's this? This is... Um, oh, Kaiser. Kaiser Crafts. Yeah, yeah, they have all these really great bling. This is a great deal. I love these. The gems? Yes. Yeah. Very Wonderful. Oh, look at this. Oh, how cute. This is Kaiser Craft also. Yeah, they have great The little wing album. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, that's darling. Cute. Oh, I like this here. Look at this one. <gasps> cute. We should try making that one a project. I like that. Funky frame pack. You get three frames in here. Ooh, Ooh. that is fun. Like I love the Graphic 45 line. And for the first time in my life, I've seen things with... Um, airplanes on it because I fly I, I like that but I love all the cherries and the vintage stuff and the travel I just you know what I like about these is um, the backgrounds are yes. very fun patterns and oh, I just let me see if I can find some of my favorite I'm just kind of guessing as to what's back here but um, they have great I Look love this. graphic 45 the cherries see oh I love, love it. it what's on the back of that one see the dot I just graphic it's 45 Okay, here's the new Glimmer Mists. These are really cool. If you haven't used them, they're all um, ready to go. And you lightly shake them. You get them going so you don't get like bubbles in there. And they're great for spraying over the white Prima flowers. That's right. You spray them on the Prima flowers. These also work great if you're doing Donna's paper flower technique. Mm -hmm. right? Adds a little shimmer. So here's more Tattered Angel, Angels. Frog. I love Tattered Angel stuff. So you get the... You get the letter, plus you get the frame letter, plus the butterfly. Okay, this is a great, I'm going to have to get cute. this. The, this is going <laughs> home with Johanna. Serious. Going home with Johanna, great. Oh, stuff. look at that. I mean, that's a, look okay. at this. Look at this. That's, a, that's deal. a deal. That's a deal. This is my friend, the dress form. So, woo, love her little skirt. So, I it's like, check this out. This is like just paper, zigzags. Yes. And, and then paper flowers. I think Mara flowers. Johnson made this. See, this die cut or punch paper flowers. Yes. It's gorgeous. Okay, now we are going to show you, actually not me, Johanna's going to show you a very cute little project that you could do to decorate your cupcakes. Yes. So go ahead. Okay. I am so into cupcakes right now. Yes. So I designed some cupcakes. I did a spring one. I gosh, no. Little butterflies. Little flying butterflies. And I did an Easter one and a birthday one. And this is all using little tiny scraps. Okay. And punches. And you know my favorites are punches. I get yes. a lot of mileage out of my punches. I do love punches. I have a one and a half inch round punch. Okay. And I punched out some circles. Okay. And then I used, for this smaller circle, I used a one and a quarter. One so and it's a just quarter. slightly smaller. Okay. okay. And so for the birthday one, I'm going to glue this down. That's this one with the cupcake? Yes. I'm going to do the birthday one. And my, um, my other scallop punch was too big, so I just took my mini scallop scissors, uh -huh. and watch how great this works. This works fabulous. And you just cut all the way around. And it almost looks like a punch. Thank so th you. then, 
I have this fabulous cupcake punch. Martha Stewart. Martha Stewart. Thank you, Martha. Thank you, Martha. <laughs> and I found this striped paper I thought looked like a cupcake bottom. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to cut one of those. Okay. Because I don't want the top out of cup, you know, out right. of stripey material. Right. And then the top I punched out of regular pink paper okay. and I glittered it. So we're going to glue that on. Oh, he's Look how cute. cute. And then we're going to glue on the and bottom. And you just took a glittered paper, huh? Uh, yes, you can use glitter paper or you can glitter the, the punch after you punch it, either way. Very cute. And then for on top, you know, I just, it had to go a little further. Got to have you know. a cherry on top. Got to have a cherry on top. And look how cute that is. So cute. Now how did you um, attach the tool? Okay. I'm going to make a little tutu. See, we made a little tutu for our um, for our little stick. Mm -hmm. This is a coffee stir. Oh. I bought a little package of coffee stirs. Co coffee stirs. That's clever. So, you know, coffee stirs. You clever girl. So, okay. I put that on with a hot glue gun. Mm -hmm. And my hot glue gun stuck. So, we're going to run a little hot glue on the back here. Look at that. And then to make the tutu, where did my tool go? Here. Here's your tool. Uh, I had some cut. There okay. Go. You take a couple pieces of tool mm -hmm. and you just tie it around the stick. Okay. Several times, like four times. Oh. And then you kind of um, swirl them around and, you know, kind of divide them up. Okay. Okay, so I did that. Okay. And then you kind of evenly space them around. And then you can take scissors. Oh, I dropped my cherry. Okay. Look at that. That's okay. Okay. Very cute. And then how do you do the little frilly thing coming off okay. the top? That. I'm glad you asked. Okay. This is how I did the frilly thing. I took a piece of fishing line. Only you would think of getting fishing line. Ordinary fishing line. And beads. And beads, okay. And so what you want to do is string some beads on your fishing line first. Okay, string the beads on the fishing line. And you go like that. You, and you put like maybe 10 on the fishing line. Okay. And then you take your really strong liquid glue. Okay. And you make a dot towards the end on the fishing line. And then you slide the bead into the glue. Oh. And then you do that again. That is such a great idea. And you just keep doing that. Yes. Until and then it's all done. you just let that dry for a while. Okay. It takes like maybe 15 minutes for it to dry. Okay. So that's ones I just did. Okay. Oh, wow. These are like stuck together. <laughs> and so those are ones I just did. Okay. And so these are again. ones. Okay, that I've that. already done. Okay, got it. Let me just show it here on the finished cupcake. I'm not sure if you can see it very well, but it's these here. Okay, so then we're going to cut this apart like that. And that's how you would make the little topper. Okay. And then we're going to add a little hot glue Okay. on the back. Ooh. Got some of Leah's make and take. And you would stick them in the hot glue. Oh, clever. Gotta love that hot glue gun. Okay, and you just put a few of them in there. And, then and you just put a few of them in there, and you keep going. Oh, Johanna, it is so So cute. I added um, this one. I did the blue with the green, and then the bunny with a pom-pom. Love the pom-pom. And then I did the same little technique. I hot glued fishing line to these little butterfly punches. And this is the butterfly punch. Okay. So, and is the bunny Martha Stewart punch also? Yes. Okay, the bunny good. is Martha Stewart, the cupcake, and the butterflies. Thank you, Martha. Thank you, Martha, for making those. And then I just put the butterfly on there, and so I have a little springtime 
little cupcake. Well, I love it. I love it. I'm definitely going to do this for Easter. How far are we from, from Easter? See, April. We're not far. We're already in Lent. Yeah. So we're like, e Easter's what, two weeks away? Oh my gosh. Weeks? Okay, so make, make some of these cupcake toppers yeah. for your Easter party. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.